Hi guys, hey everyone, how are y'all doing out there? Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, good night, good twilight, good whatever it is where you are. It's a girl twin deep. Thank you so so much for stopping by the channel. Thank you all for being here, for liking, sharing, and subscribing. Especially those of you guys who are subscribing and watching these videos. Big up on yourself and my longtime subscribers. You guys keep me going. So enough respect to you all. Big up on yourself. Oh, messages are coming out already. Let's see what's going on here. This is messages from your masculine. So let's see what they want to say to you. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thine will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever amen all right if you're new here i say my prayer at the beginning of every single message to make sure i'm protected and covered and your messages are coming from the right place so just so you understand what's going on here anyways guys let's jump in and see messages from your person let's see what they want to say to you today because they've been doing a lot of thinking and i know because I haven't been able to <clears throat> I haven't been able to like put out as many messages as I know I should or I want to and the messages are just bundled up here so I know <laughs> so let's see what's going on what do you want to say to your divine feminines divine masculines what messages do you have for them today oh thank you for not falling off <laughs> Ah, oh boy, I'm still trying to get over my ex and related wounds. Please give me space while I heal and know once I lick my wounds, I'll come to you properly healed. I've really been through the ringer. So we got somebody here who has been really, really hurt before. Really, really hurt in relationships, from people in their life, the lovers in their lives. And right now, they just want to let you know, like, hey, I'm just taking the time to lick my wounds. I'm just taking the time to heal. I'm just taking the time to get away from all this mess and become a good person for you. Because I do not want to take this energy that I feel now out on you. I, I, I got to heal from this. Properly healed. It no half ass anything. Properly healed. I want to be the best. It's just like the message before. I want to be the best version of myself for you. What else do you want to say here? I know you think your body isn't perfect. But it's heaven to me. And I often think about and look forward to exploring it. And how to pleasure you beyond what you've known. I want you so bad. Okay. So they're longing for you, Divine Feminine, wanting to be with you. But pay attention to the very first message that we, we, we read here. The, I know you think your body isn't perfect. So whoever this Divine Feminine in is, you may have this energy of not liking yourself. There's something wrong with me. I don't know what to do about what's wrong with me. I can't change it. I want to change it. Whatever confusion you may have about yourself. They're letting you know that you are perfect for them. It doesn't matter what you think. You are perfect. So you may not love you, but they do. I've had enough of this. I want you in my life now. Please just let me do this on my own terms. And trust me, I'm coming sooner than you may think. I just can't take this pain anymore. So they are suffering without you. They are suffering. I miss my person. I miss my person very much. Whatever they're facing, whatever they're going through, they know they have to. But one, one thing they know for sure is the way that they feel, they can't handle it anymore. I'm suffering. I want to be near my person. I want to be around them. I want to be able to hold them in my arms. I want to be able to just look at them and take long walks down the street and, you know, just be happy. Just be happy. So this person is trying to let you know the way that they're feeling about you as well. So there may be some form of um, like communication coming through. Whether through signs, symbols, synchronicities, 
music, whatever it is, telepathic communication. This person is also trying to let you know how they feel. Because they're actually hurting not being with you. But again, they know they have to heal before they can come. Oops. Turns out you were right. My ego is bruised. But I ultimately want you in my life more than I need to be right. I just have to swallow my pride a minute. As I'm not used to this feeling. So they had big egos. They had big egos. And because I have this big old ego, hey... I got to heal not only from past hurt, but that's the main reason why they have this big ego. Because they're trying not to be hurt again. So whatever you've been saying to them, Divine Feminine, whatever conflicts you guys may have had in regards to how they are treating you, communicating with you, it's because of their ego. And they're figuring that out. They're not used to being told that they are not doing the right thing. But here you are telling them. They may have been upset when they told when you told them this. But now they're figuring out you were right. You were right all along. I want to call our visit so badly, but I have to do but I have so much to do right now before I feel I can give you the time and attention you deserve. But I'm working you up my list of priorities. That's a promise. 636. Six. So Divine Feminine, it seems like you may have wanted, to, um, let me fix this. It seems like you may have wanted this person to communicate with you more. Give you some attention. But it's like they never had the time for you. They were never ever available to talk to you to be around you. Wow. But they do want to talk to you. They do want to call you. But it, to them, it's like it feels like they're wasting your time. If they should just come in one moment. And they're, they're not there the next. They know you deserve the time. Their time. They know you deserve attention. Their attention. But there are some things in their life that they need to clear up to get rid of before they can come forward to you. And like they say, they're working you up. They're working you up that list, that priority list. And soon you'll be number one. Because <laughs> that's only what we, I know. We should be number one, right? Just as how we put them at number one. Why aren't we number one too? And these are like some of the things that should make you question how much time you give to somebody. Am I their number one priority? I'm putting them at my number one priority. I can find time to say, how are you? How are you doing? But they can't find the time to say, how are you? How are you doing? Just because you're working to put me at the top of your list. But at the same time, you still got to reach out, right, Divine Masculine? Just to see how you are. Just to see if you're okay. You don't have to do everything all at once. Because it's never going to re get resolved all at once. So it's like, it's like it's reassurance. That's what it is. Reassurance that you're their divine masculine. Reassurance that you still want to talk to the divine feminine. Reassurance that you're still interested in divine feminine. Well, like they say, they're promising you, they're promising you, they're going to work on things so that they can give you the attention you deserve. Because you deserve it and they know it. Because you've been giving them all your attention, even when nobody else is. So they know that you're worth it. You see that? I wish you knew just how special you are to me. It kills me not to be able to tell you. You amaze me with your compassion and kindness through this time apart. I promise I'll make this up to you. You see that? That just sums up everything I was saying. I've been lying to you or hiding from you out of fear or to save face. However, I've pushed you away. Just know it was a lie and I feel terrible. 
I will get honest with you at a future date. Mm -hmm. That's why they, they're hurting because they're away from you because all the things they've been saying. Look at that. I'm convincing myself I'm happy when they're not. They're, they're not happy without you. They're not happy. What's in their heart here? I have some overbearing and controlling people in my life. I'm afraid we'll try to control you too. So I'm working on good boundaries and gaining respect before bringing you into this dynamic. Yeah. So just like the last message says, I'm working on everything. Working on them so I can get them out the way and put you as my number one priority. Give me another message here, Divine Masculine. That you would want to say to your divine feminine. What are you feeling? What, what do you want to let them know? Childhood trauma. Everything they're experiencing is from their past. Like I was saying, they were they were, they were never told that they are wrong. They were never told that they are they shouldn't behave the way that they're behaving. And now it's taking a toll on their present present moment and life i want out yeah I, I can't do this anymore i want out i'm running away from these things I, I need to get back yeah painful memories so they allow these negative memories and emotions that they have to keep you two apart but they're learning yeah i don't understand yeah so they need to figure it out they need to figure it out that's why they're taking that time and space. I need to hold back my true feelings for you. And that's because when they're expressing their true feelings, they want you to be that first priority. Nothing else after they reveal the way they truly feel. Because they're going to come honest. And they're going to tell you how they truly feel. And then it's going to start over from there. They, they don't want to go back. They don't want to be in and out. So I'm holding back everything until that moment is perfect. It's never a perfect moment, Divine Masculine. But hey, who are we to complain? <laughs> let things flow. It's hard to hear, but you got to let things flow. God got this. You know, God has got it. Your masculine's got it too. We just got to continue to do us, work on us, pay attention to our lives. Learn that we also deserve and need respect in our lives too. But take care of yourselves out there, guys. Love you all. Let go and let God. And I'll see you at your next message later. Oh, don't forget that I'll be having the um, $5 how your person feels about you tonight at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So make sure that you purchase on my website twindyflamed.square.site find it under specials it's um it's five dollars guys if you're in the u.s it may be around three dollars for you so well it's cheaper if you purchase on my website and if you don't get the chance to purchase on my website you can purchase at the live when we begin using your super chat all right love you all and i see you at your next message later let go and let god